problem, line A is parallel to line B. So where's that? Let's label that. Line A, right here, is parallel to line B. So these two purple lines are parallel. And line R is a transversal. That's this line right here. So it means it's a line that cuts across the others. Which pair of angles must have the same measure? Let's look at our options. They first say 1 and 6. Oops, fix that, wrong tool. Angle 1 is an exterior angle. It's on the outside and on the left side of our transversal. Angle 6 is an interior angle on the right side. Um, 1 and 6 might be equal, but they don't have to have the same measure, so that's out. Angle 1 and angle 7. Well, angle 7 does not correspond to angle 1. Angle 7 is equal to angle 6. And since we don't know that 1 and 6 are equal, we don't know that 1 and 7 are equal. Our next choice is 2 and, and 7. Where's 2? Here's 2. Let's label this. Okay, well, 2 I know equals 3. And 3 is in the same corresponding part as 7. So all these red angles have to be equal to each other. So 2 and 7 do have to equal each other. And in fact, I think you would call them alternate exterior angles because they're on the outside, right? And they're alternate. They're on different sides of our transversal. Let's look at the last option. 3 and 5. Well, 3 and 5 might equal each other, but they they are both interior angles on the same side of the transversal, and in fact they have to add up to 180, which is a neat property, but that's not what we're looking for here. They are supplementary. We're looking for equal angles. Alright, hope that helped.